Welcome, problem solving fans, to another problem of the day. And this one's all about tens and hundreds. How many hundreds must be added to 12,900 to make 13,000? Well, there's a couple of ways you can think about this. Some of you may be able to just do it in your head and figure out that the difference between 12,900 and 13,000 is 100. So the answer to the first one is 100, which you could write as 100 or 100. Either way, because it's asking us how many hundreds. You could think about that one as if you're counting up in hundreds, you could have 12,500, 12,600, 12,700, 12,800, 12,900, and the next stop after 900 makes it up to the next 1,000. So the next 1,000 after 12,000 would be 13,000. So that's another reason why if we're going up in 100s, you only add on 100 to get up to 13,000. Of course, you could also do a column method. You could just find the difference between them. So 13,000 subtract 12,900 would go like this. 0 take 0 is 0. 0 take 0 is 0 again. 0 take 9, you can't do, so you would borrow from the 3 and call it a 2. And the 1 you've borrowed makes that into 10. 10 take away 9 is 1. 2 take away 2 is 0. And 1 take away 1 is also 0. So again, we've got our answer of 100. The second question says how many 10s must be added to 3,600 to make 4,000? Well, again, if you, you should be able to see that the difference between them is 400. So we need to know how many 10s are in 400. Well, you could do a bus shelter to divide that. So 10s into 400. 10s into 4 won't go but because 10 is bigger than 4. But you haven't really used the 4 yet, so you would carry the 4 to make 40. 10s into 40 goes 4 times with nothing left over. And 10s into 0 won't go. So your final answer is 40. 40 10s make 400. And that's what we need to add on to 3,600 to make 4,000. So how many 10s must be added to make 4,000? The answer is 40.